I am plus size. I've recently lost some weight, so that means that I am a smaller size now. It used to be a size three and a size four, but I am now looking into the three two-ish area. And this is all the cute little stuff that I got now. Fall's coming up, so I wanted to get like some really cute fall pieces to add to my collection. Um, it looks like for this I got two X just to show you guys it's kind of like a little cheeky um half-sized jean it's all white which is dangerous because i'm a messy eater but that's okay we'll figure it out if there's an issue with that uh because it's halloween in my house as soon as august 1st rolls around it is halloween time and it's time for us to be spooky so I got this in a 2X. It's a cute little Minnie Mouse shirt. And then, so I was like really wanting to like really hit the fall, even though it's still like really hot outside. Um, I wanted to get the fall colors. I know this is more of like a corally color, but I just thought that this was so like Thanksgiving, like this little design here. Uh, not sure what it's called specifically, whirly, something like that. I did get this in a three because I wanted it to like flow off of me a little bit better. And now my favorite thing and the thing I'm most excited for other than my boots. So this gave me like such like a 90s like cottage core, um, lesbian tastic vibe, and I was really into it. So looks like this if you've ever seen hocus pocus which i'm sure you have um it gives me like very like allison it feels so nice and it has like this like really really pretty um knit detailing in it where it's like little circles i don't know i think it's adorable and i am so excited to wear it put it in my collection and love it for the rest of my life now, last but not least for my torrid side of things, I did get boots. I don't wear boots too often, but I wanted the to be able, that makes a horrible noise, I'm sorry. Um, I wanted to be able to have something that was cute to wear. Um, obviously wide cap since I'm plus size. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say plus size, but you know, make it known. But yeah, they're a little bikery, but I feel like like with the perfect like outfit, they will totally look good. And yeah, so that's it for my Torrid haul. Now there's still some other stuff because obviously I couldn't just have this and this be it. Now, today is actually my best friend's birthday. So I wanted to celebrate that and so I got him a little something something that I'm actually going to be handing to him now, but I got him an essential oil diffuser and humidifier. Got him a little blue one. Now this is just what he's going to get for right now, but I do have a Scentsy haul that's going to be coming up, so stay tuned for that and that will have another present for him in there. I'm going to go ahead and hand this off to him. Um, now, something, as I said, August 1st hits and it's now Halloween. Um, so I did get some black candles because I have some candle offers in my living room that I will be putting these in. Right now there's some candles in there, but I'm feeling like black is gonna be more of a speed. All right. And then I got some really cute prints. They're Hocus Pocus themed. Um, it's all just a bunch of Hocus Pocus, which I thought was super cute. Um, this one says, oh look, another glorious morning. Makes me sick, Winifred, of course. Um, this is the spell of when they turn Banks into a cat. Twist the bones and bend the back. Um, I'm not gonna read the rest of it because it's really long, but this is super cute. And then who lit the black? flame candle obviously something that we have to have here so these are going to be going up on my wall shortly i don't have much decor right now because i've literally just moved into my apartment so 
on my own. So that's super exciting. I know that fall is going to, you know, November fall, harvest fall is going to be on the way soon. So I did get some cute, this is all from Amazon by the way, but I get get some, some cute pumpkins here or pumpkins are on them, but they're for pillows. Um, this is pumpkin spice, everything nice, which I thought was super cute for the harvest season. This says autumn harvest, obviously, for the harvest season. This says meet me at the pumpkin patch, which I, this is the reason why I got this set because I just thought that was a darling. And then, my the last one. It's fall, y'all, because I am technically southern-ish. <laughs> now, um, we don't have all of the Target goodies Halloween goodies, so it's more of just like a harvest thing. But I did get a clothing item. Here it is. Oh, she is gorgeous. I love her with everything in my soul. As soon as I saw her, I was like, I gotta get it. Um, this is actually a 2X. So now I did try it on. She's a little tight in the uh, bubbies area. But, you know, with a bra, it'll look really nice. Um, more than just a sports bra. So there's that. I thought that was super cute, very harvesty. Now we do have like a little bit of Halloween, I guess, just a little bit. Um, this is called Spellbound Sangria. It's like a lemony scent. Oh, it smells so good. And it comes in like a tiny little cauldron, very cute. Um, I got some black flame candles, if you will. I know they're not the black flame candles, but um, they're super cute. You, they're LED. You just pop in some batteries, and then they start flickering, and they're all cute. So I will be putting those up shortly. That's probably the most Halloween that we're going to get from this haul. And then we do have a pumpkin spice um, things up, which is a glade candle. My glade candles that I got recently from Big Lots like, well, they were gone in basically a day and a half. So I decided that I was gonna really go hog wild and get not just one, two, three, but four of the same scented candle so that my whole sm house can smell like pumpkin spice, which I think that anyone can aspire to have unless you just simply hate pumpkin spice smells. And then last but not least, um, actually wait, no, just kidding, not last but not least, um, quick Walmart haul, they are having all their spooky things come out, so we have a cute little shirt here that I saw last night, I went shopping with my mama, and a little ghostess with the mostess, um, which I thought was super cute, and she got one that was very similar that was in a witch style. So I thought that was fun. This I will literally be wearing to Thanksgiving because it is so comfortable and so cute on me. As you can see, it's got like, um, not an A-line, but it's like cinched in the, right under the boobular, halfway down the belly. It's super cute on my body type because, um, I guess I'll show you guys. I do have like kind of a pear body shape where I'm bigger down here. Um, a little bit smaller up here. I would say that if I turn around real quick, you can kind of see obviously a little belly here and I've got some bat wings, if you will, um, for the holiday season. <laughs> um, that uh, needs hiding. So these types of dresses do wonders for me because they cup where I want to and then it flows out. So that belly's kind of unnoticed. Now, this, I was, I did try this on because I wanted to make sure that it fit, but I am a huge Jack Skellington fan, Nightmare Before Christmas, and I thought that this little set, it came with socks. Look at how long they are. So cute, great for the holiday season. And then my little, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And it is so soft, y'all. 
Um, this is a 3X because you never know with Walmart. Sometimes like things can be a little snug. Sometimes it's really nice and size wise. I would say that this is a little bit bigger on me than I was expecting, which is a nice surprise. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to be able to sport that during the colder um, days. And last but not least from Walmart, um, this cute little, um, I don't know what to call it, peplum? I don't know. But it does that thing where it cinches in and then it goes out flowy um, so that the uh, belly doesn't show. And then, last but not least, my favorite haul. I don't know why there's trash bags in here, but there are. Um, this is just like the list of everything that I bought, which was, I don't want to be reminded of, so, <sighs> I'm so excited. Um, I've been literally waiting to open this for this haul video because it's something that I've really wanted to do. I'm like, obviously a consumer of things, so I really think that it's sweet to be able to like share and go over what we all get. So. For me to do my part for that, here is vanilla pumpkin. Is there anything else? Marshmallow. Vanilla pumpkin marshmallow. It smells like a dream. Honestly, so good. It's it's definitely gonna get burned here soon. Now I did get another one. This one's and something that's really cute is the detailing on these has like pumpkins all around. So like the little top is even decorative. I think that's pretty cool. And then while I flip it out of there, that's cool. Pumpkin peanut brittle. Smells exactly how you think. Super cute, good packaging. Again, has that design. I wanted to be able to scent my whole house without breaking the bank. So these are like two, no. They look specifically the nightlight projectors and they are four dollars and eighty cents so that's pretty chill um i did decide to get some wall plugs for my different um actual plugins i've got pumpkin uh waffles pumpkin apple i think this is another pumpkin waffle champagne apple and honey and then another pecan waffle pumpkin pecan waffle and this is so cute. Um, their line of wall um, decor things are super cute this time of the year. I would say that I like this year better than any because this is so cute. It is definitely my style. Um, this one will be going into my room because if you look around a little bit, there's some different, more elegant, pink, cutesy style. And that's totally me. And then I also obviously have the spooky style. And then we come to this. The holy grail of all wall plugins. So not only is it beautiful in every single way, it also has, if you notice this little detail, there's like a little boiling pot, um, which is like a little witch's pot. Um, it does have some glitter on it, which is really cute. But the thing that I love most about it is that when you plug it in, there's a little projection of a witch which I thought was super cute. This was only $32.50, which was great. Both the pumpkin um, candles were $24.50, so I think I bought those at full price, and then the rest of it, as you know, um, pretty uh, pretty within the range of the four eighty. dollars So that's pretty cool. So I think that's it. I have now destroyed my room that I need to clean up. Uh, and I am going to be cooking my BFF some steak and scallops, which we're going to have tonight for dinner, and I need to finish frosting the strawberry funfetti cake that you baked out. I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching my video. I definitely appreciate it, and if you like it, um, you like the content that I've given you, uh, subscribe, leave a comment. Um, and if you go down below, you'll be able to see all of my other socials that you can follow as well. Thanks so much and have a great day. Bye!